There's a surprising number of things you can do when you're in Jamaica, but most people tend to stick with the usual stuff, like the beach or parties. I am not one of those people. So, this past Saturday, I met up with my brother in Stephen to try a new kind of adventure. Well, new to me at least. Today, we'll be going off-roading. Alright folks, we get some good light. So we're out here um, and we we'll link up with we're bridging Stephen. Stephen and we're out here with the 2021 VW Amarok and we join with Stephen's Amarok. So we have two Amaroks and we're going up under the hill and we're heading to Halliwell. But we're not heading to Halliwell via the usual route, right Stephen? No. No, we are at the we are, we are the difficult route to Hollywood. More adventurous route. More adventurous route. Most people, when heading to Hollywood, would make their way to Papine, then up into the hills via Irish Stone Road, passing through communities like Red Glide and Newcastle. We would be going to Hollywood from the other side of the hill. So we are head up into the hills, and we're gonna do a little bit of off-roading with the van them today, and see where this thing is all about. I've never done the route, but I've heard it's a really Cool route to drive, you can't drive the route without a 4x4 and well we have two 4x4 so we're gonna do that thing and so I'll go on feet. With that we started our journey up the hill, navigating the winding narrow roads in search of adventure. When on adventure though there's one rule you need to follow and that is always be aware of your surroundings. Our cameraman, my nephew, did not pay attention to rule number one. Woo! We made our way from the foothills of Norbrook towards the community of Woodford. But before we got there, we had to stop to take in the views. We didn't stay long though and got back to the journey at hand. I come up with regular tires, dog. I just realized. One of the things that was never truly captured oh. was how narrow these roads were, like at this point for example. But we managed to make it past these tight spots with no problem. The plan was to make a quick stop in Woodford to get some supplies for the drive up. But when we got there, none of the shops were open, so we just took some pictures and made our way up the hill. We weren't 100% sure where we were going, so we stopped along the way whenever we could to get some directions. In next to no time, we went from asphalt to gravel to dirt, signaling the beginning of our adventure. The suspension in the pickup was working overtime to make the drive way more comfortable than it should have been. Even then, you couldn't help but noticing the change in the road surface. 
and it was only gonna get worse from here. We got to a fork in the road and wasn't sure whether to go left or right and Google Maps told us we were miles behind in the direction we were coming from. Yo, bring up Google Maps. Which way? This way? Yeah. Alright. Movement. Movement. No sooner than we decided, it started to rain and on the way up, we met a rather brave soul. Alright, so... We have a <laughs> we have an addition to the journey, you know. So on our way up, we came across this gentleman behind us in the Navitara, and apparently he 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 attempted to drive up, um, and I guess him get a little bit nervous by himself, you know? Never want to try it by himself, so. He turn back and say I'm willing to do it if we go. So, we have a new addition to the journey. Road to kill you. I did a joke and them say, yo, 4x4 four four only. <laughs> oh. Hold on, somebody, come on. Alright, so I'm not sure what I'll go on. Stephen, who is leading in his Amarok. Um, the signal to me to stop, so is us and Bertrand around about the guitar. I'm not entirely sure what is happening, um, so I'm going to find out. Uh, being the genius that I am, I have left my umbrella in the bed of the pickup, and I don't know with all I have other cap with. Some holy nights, so you know, Una go out in area. So we wait. This not look good. Alright, mm -hmm. I'm told that the road is very bad up here, right? So him probably can't make it. In comparison to what? We got through here? Right. This is a toll road. Jaja. Yeah. So him probably have to turn back. We try. Well, I don't, I don't cool. <laughs> yeah. The man just called. Well, we drive for a while at the toll road. Blows and skirt. I want to get myself in a jar. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. I'm going to school. Yes. They probably have a good tour. Pull him. All right. Cool. I'm nervous and I'm still. Nervous and yeah, no. Still, the man said, Well, we come up a while ago, it's the toll road compared to where we're going. We resumed our drive up the hill, but then we noticed that the driver of the Vitar got stopped by the resident that spoke to Stephen earlier. A second warning made him decide not to continue the drive, but he asked to come with us if we ever did the drive again. So, back to the original plan. That's the end. Let's pick him up real quickly. Honey. 
Alright, yep. Nothing serious? No. Okay. Alright, cool. No one can't see it, but somewhere down in there is 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 the city of Kingston. There we go. It down there, man. Just just take my word for it. It down there. Approaching the border of St. Andrew and Portland, we stop to take in the crisp, clean air and the majestic hills. Problems. With the rain coming down, the terrain gave us a little trouble. But it was nothing the Amarok couldn't handle. On the road, brother. People, watch on one, watch on one, and Steve have our regular tire people. See, Steve have our regular tires, we have our off road tires. So, that is just a testament because if Steve have my can go up this and this are mud, this are not even like thing they're bridging, this are like. Mud. No problem. No problem. No problems. No problems whatsoever. Come on. Come on. Easy. Well, I think we're almost. We're almost at Hollywell. Um, it was a nice drive. It was a really, really nice drive. Uh, not as 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 dangerous or treacherous as I thought it would have been largely in part because of what I came up here in VW Amarok um, listen man this yes yes see where I go on here that one here is the off-roader of off-roaders trust me I'm gonna I'm gonna just say that because VW give me them van for drive drive it and I see it for myself and my bridging have one and as I say he has on regular street tires and him come up the hill like there's no problem at all another thing with the camera now showing him is how freaking narrow these roads are bridging because trust me 
Ui. Mighty. All right. If Steve do it, we can do it. No problem. What so? Oh. Oh. Easy no man! Woo! Steven, don't want to see that ditch there a while ago when we got you. Oh, Steve, no, stop, Steve, gone. Right, it, all right. Steve, can get no some trouble this up. All right. Lows and skirt, yeah? No, Aye. No, no, that, 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 Eh? And up in all like a tough spot, yeah. See, I can't go on, I know.
people after my day I talk about uneventful just a little event a while ago and one worse I want to come off so so sandal yeah sandal so sandal so there's a pack right there so see but if not we cannot turn back. Hold on. You're going to take up the same. V class, can it? Yeah. <laughs> 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 So we have make sure so we don't stuck him and say that the sound right. Yeah. That's all right. Yo, we need to see that shot. How much the tail slide? Slide wide? Yeah, my slide wide. Shit. And with that, we made it to Halliwell. It was a hell of a drive, and we enjoyed every second of it. The rains prevented us from capturing a lot of what we wanted, so we'll definitely have to redo this one sometime in the near future. Hopefully, if you're up to it, you'll join us. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. <laughs>